Okay, I'm gonna show you how to do some pretty cool things with your TI-84. You might be able to do it with the 83 as well, but anything above an 84, now you'll be able to do this. So yeah, first go to mode. On this, it's the button right next to the blue second function key. Go to mode. Switch it from, it says, funk to pole. This is switching it from functional mode to polar graphing mode and then from radians to degrees hit y equals top left button and enter in the equation sine of 19 theta theta key is where the x key normally would be in function diagonally down one from the second button but anyway sine of 19 theta divided by 20 and then hit window, set the theta maximum to 7200, set the theta step to 90, hit zoom, and then zoom to fit. And it'll take a couple seconds to process, but you get that. That's pretty darn cool. You can square it by hitting zoom 5. That. Now to make cool stuff with this, you mess around with the theta step value. Change it, say it's at 90 now, change it to 60, hit graph, and you get this. Kind of spiderweb looking thing. Change it to, let's do 45, and again, spiderweb type thing. change it to 15 and you get sort of an orb it'll take a bit for it to, it'll take a bit yeah for it to graph but <coughs> but yeah so mess around with that a bit and uh, you should get some pretty good things at least enough to keep you entertained during uh, a math class. <laughs> yeah, enjoy.